What up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's she a guy. Some, some, some. Hit the keys here today with eight freebies to start your May off right. I'll make sure if you guys do like this content, though, you drop a whole elbow on that like button, hit subscribe and that notification bell so every time we bring you guys a new video, you can be the first to see. But let's get right into these eight plugins, baby, and they free. Some, some, some hit the key. All right, guys, and the first free plugin that I have for you guys is really a reboot of an old plugin, but it's got a bunch of new stuff added to it. It's from my guy, a goose hardman, Monster Daw. It's called Monster Piano. So when you take a look at the new Monster Piano, you see here it's got a new GUI. Um, it's also got effects on it now. So you got reverb, you got delay, you got chorus, you got distortion, um, you got your ADSR down here, you can pan, you can filter, you got volume controls here. But what's cool is I believe this only had six to eight pianos before. Now it has like 18. So you have like a whole bunch of different pianos, different grands, different electrics, different experimentals and some uprights. I'll go ahead and play a few of them for you. Yeah, it's got some experimental pianos. They sound pretty interesting. Uh, let's check this one out. So as you can tell there, there's a whole bunch of different panels that you can go through. Very, very usable free plugin in my opinion. The second free plugin that I have from you guys today comes from a Goose Hardman <laughs> monster doll and it's called Monster Sax. So when you open up Monster Sax, it looks like this. I'm not really sure how long this has been out. I don't even know how this isn't on my radar, uh, but it's a pretty solid little saxophone uh, free VST. Uh, we'll go ahead and take a listen real quick. Now, what's cool about this is each one of these um, affects down here the key switches. So you can actually go through the little different key switches. So I'll push it on this. Uh, normally, I would just push it on the keyboard, but like watch. So you see, I would switch it to legato over here, and then you can mess with how much you want the legato to come in or any of these, how much you want them to come in. And then if I switch to another key switch, it'll just keep doing the same thing. And then the C1 takes it back to the original sound. Um, so another thing that's cool about this, do things to spice up your saxophone. So, you know, and again, I'm gonna push play. Right, but we can get it to sound a little better if we just add a little bit of delay and a little bit of reverb. Now it's gonna sound like this. And then mixed in with that piano, um, it sounds like this. Coming up third on this list of free plugins I have for you guys today comes from Spitfire Audio Labs and it's called Obsolete Machines. So when you come over here and look at Obsolete Machines, it looks like everything else Spitfire Audio, um, but it's basically a synth that's been beat up <laughs> or old synth sound. So it sounds kind of like this.
but it's going to be some old school synthy sound and stuff. So, you know, if you're into that, you're in the Spitfire Audio Labs, it's free. Go grab it. And the fourth free plugin that I have for you guys today comes from Linda Audio and it's called Super Crunch. Um, so when you take a look over here at Super Crunch, it's basically an amp simulation. Um, so you got your input, your drive, lead or crunch, um, EQ, um, you got brightness, clean blend, output, a bunch of different controls, some gate. You can blend between cabinet A and B and you got an EQ right here. Um, so this is what the guitar sounded like before I threw the Super Crunch on there. And then after I threw the Super Crunch on there, I got it to sound like this. Obviously, you can go between lead and crunch and mess with the drive. You can always mess with the bright and the output over here. So it's not a bad little distortion plugin. You can also add some delay and some reverb to it and get it to sound like this. So then with the uh, piano and the saxophone, I'm um, in all the melodic pieces. Um, I basically got the beat to sound like this. Fifth on this list today is from Superfly DSP. It's called Lost Samplers. Um, so when you look at Lost Samplers, this is a pretty nice effect for like down sampling or adding some just grit and grime to whatever it is that you're doing. Um, so if you have this bad boy on at full pace and you push play, it's gonna sound gnarly. You get to control the length in which the, the effect takes place. Um, so the higher you have it up, it doesn't follow as much. So listen. If you have the link down a little bit more, it's a little longer. So like as the length is up, it's ducking. So up here you have stutter and looper effects. I don't really mess with them because it's like uh, static and it up uh, a lot. What I actually like to do with this is I like to turn this down over here on the mixer if I'm gonna use it. So I'm just getting a little bit of the artifacts. Now listen. And then I can mess with the down sampling. You got 8-bit, 9-bit, 10-bit, and 12-bit. And we can turn this up. We can add artifacts. So this is definitely a good lo-fi tool. Um, if you like to destroy your sound, crunch your sound, it's good for drums too. So, you know, go grab it. And the sixth free plugin that I have for you guys today is an absolute gem. It's called Goyo Voice Separator. Uh, so when you open up Goyo Voice Separator, it looks like this. Um, what this is really good for is basically separating stuff from your vocal, your vocal audio. So like, let's say you're in a room recording and there's a lot of reverby and a lot of ambience in the background it'll take out that reverb and it'll take out that ambience. Or like if you're having a recording and the recording is bleeding over into the microphone, it'll take out a little bit of that bleeding. So this is gonna sound ignorant for a second. It might be true, it might not be, I don't know. But uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna use the Goyo on this. So basically I'm gonna hit bypass to start and this is what the vocal sounded like. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Ah, ah. Ah. Nobody has to tell me I have no common sense. I already knew that before I started this video. Um, but now like, listen to it. We can hit this ambience and we can start taking out the ambience and the, and the voice reverb. So check this out. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Ah, ah, ah. So you guys hear that as I'm pulling down on the knobs, it's taking out that background sound. It doesn't take out everything. It ain't perfect, but you're gonna get a much cleaner mix with the second vocal than the first one. So let's listen to it just one more time. So we'll go ahead and hit bypass. So I was 
on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Now we'll hit it one more time. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Ah, ah, ah. So as you can see, it does a pretty good job of taking away the background noise when the vocal was going. So you might still have to do a little bit of editing just to get that little first part out, but when the voice is going, it takes out everything. So that's cool, definitely a great tool. So in the theme of where we're going with this nonsense from here, the seventh free plugin is a gem as well. It's called Soundly Place It. Uh, so Soundly Place It basically just emulates different speakers. Look, I wouldn't tell y'all to use this to mix your track down or to use this as like a means to check your mixes in other places, but you can get some really cool filter effects with this and you can use this to do some pretty cool stuff. So like, you know, again, here's what that, uh, that vocal sounded like. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Ah, all right. Now, once I put the soundly placing on there, I got it to sound like this. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Ah, ah, ah. And then I put that out. I also put that on the piano. Um, so I put it on the piano for the intro. Um, and then I put a little automation clip on there. So the piano sounds like this. <laughs> and so then ultimately I used all that as the intro of the song and the beat sounded like this. So I was on my way to your mama's house the other day when I ran into your auntie. Yo, and so like all these tools you can use for so many different things, but you can use all of that, that, that speaker that place it, you can use all that plugin to give yourself different filter effects and different switch ups on your beat. Very solid plugin. And the last free plugin that I have for you guys today, I couldn't get the plugin to download, <laughs> but I'll explain it to you. Um, it's called Natura by New Nation LLC. Um, so you can get this over at VST Alarm. Um, and, and right now I just believe that the site has been swarmed with uh, orders for it. So the site just probably overloaded. Um, that's what I'm thinking, but you know, you can still come in here and you can still get your promo code. You can still get your serial number and all that stuff. You just got to wait for the site not to be swamped because I know a bunch of people were putting out videos over this plugin over the weekend. Um, and so, you know, if you have a site that doesn't expect that many people to come through and now all of a sudden 10,000 people came through, it's just going to be down. So there's plenty of demonstrations out there. You can check it out and see if this is something that you want. It's only going to be free for seven more days at the time of this video. Um, and then they also have a free drill drum kit that they're giving away as well. So this drill drum kit has like 90 different melody, all bunch of stuff in it, man, but it's free. So that's what I got for you guys today. I hope you guys can get something out of one of these plugins today. I feel like there's some solid stuff in here as always. Uh, make sure if you guys do like this content though, you drop a whole elbow on that like button, hit subscribe and that notification bell. So every time we bring you guys a new video, you can be the first to see. Appreciate you guys' time as always, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Some, some, some hit the key.